girls? Your mother and I are getting divorced. Don't cry. I know you're upset. I know you're confused. I don't know what your mother told you, but let me explain it from my side in terms you can understand. You got your doll, right? You got your doll there. Yeah. You got your doll. You like your doll, right? Yes. You love your doll. Yeah. Yes. You love the doll. But what if I told you that was the only doll you were allowed to play with the rest of your life? How would you feel? Sad. You'd feel sad. Of course, because there's a lot of other dolls on your shelves. And if you play with the other dolls, you can't have that doll anymore. Even though that doll doesn't really want to play with you at this point. You're both living a lie. There's other dolls you like, and they're making new dolls every year. You want a stewardess doll? Yeah. yeah. What about a slightly overweight cocktail waitress doll? Yeah. What about a doll who happens to be best friends with your main doll? Yeah. yeah. It could happen, right? Yeah. What about a doll you only play with one day and never see again? Yeah. What about a doll where your friend's playing with a doll and he needs you to, you know, kind of man up with the other doll? You don't even want to play with that doll, but you do it because your friend's playing with that doll. You don't want to sit there and leave the other doll unattended. Yeah. So that's why me and mom are getting divorced. Monogamy isn't realistic. Monogamy isn't realistic. Again. Monogamy isn't realistic. Again.